Hey friends, my name is Jason Pamer and I'm the producer writer on the film The Heart of Man. If you're seeing this right now, you help shape culture in New Zealand. And we're so excited to be partnering uh, with Heritage and with you to get this word out about the theatrical release of the film in June. In fact, we're so excited we're coming down, we're bringing part of our team down to break bread with you, to sit around tables with you, in the living rooms with you, to be at screenings with you, to share the bigger story about what this film is about and how it's impacted our lives. Uh, and just real briefly, I want to explain that this is a seven-year journey for our team. Uh, the film originally was called The Hearts of Men, and it was being filmed all around the world, South Africa, Southeast Asia. Tony Anderson and Derek Hamicky were confronting sex trafficking, that epidemic and that crime syndicate all around the world. And they were focusing on men, the demand side of this whole issue. And they were trying to figure out what was causing these men to go into these brothels to be buying these girls. And they discovered at the core of it was this lust, this uh, insatiable lust. And what they found though is that the same thing was in their hearts. The same thing that they were going to try to crush was something that was breeding inside of their own souls. And so it kind of created this conflict. The very thing they wanted to squash was the very thing that had control of their souls, their heart. Uh, and so that began a twist in the journey, and this is where my team came to bear, and we joined forces with this team. And we said, what's, what's the better yes? What's the most true thing about us in the midst of our giving in? And I'm not even talking about giving in sexually. It could be anything, any sort of addiction. Uh, giving in to the voice of shame. And we've all experienced in our lives that insidious lie, the whisper in our ear, uh, that you are not as good as the Father says you are that what's happened to you or what you've done defines you. And what we say in the Heart of Man film is it's not true. You are much more saint than you are just a saved sinner. And that the Father is with you in the caves of your life and on the cliff tops of your life. And he's gently playing, inviting and wooing you back to his side. He's showing you there's something much more real and textured in these moments. Something that will fulfill you in such a greater way. And that gentle invitation is a lifetime invitation. And it never changes. No matter how many times we get up from that feast table that he's laid in front of us, no matter how many times we get on the ground beneath the table, groveling and eating the crumbs, he's there to put his hand on our shoulder, to bring us back up to the table, and to show us the five course meal that's been laid before us, and to invite us to dine with him. And that's what this big film is about. It's a journey into the heart of man, but more specifically the heart of the father for us in the midst of these moments. And so we're so excited to get this message out, this message that crushes shame, reveals the tenderheartedness of the Father, and we can't wait to be with you in June.